I'm here today to shine a light on the outstanding work of the men and women of the Los Angeles City Fire Department who are working tirelessly around the clock in our Emergency Operations Center as well as our Department Operations Center. These two organizational elements allow me to gain real-time situational awareness of large-scale complex incidents. I know about logistics, planning, budgeting, any problems that are encountered, and I'm able to make real-time critical decisions based on this information. So I wanna say thank you to the hard work of the men and women of the Los Angeles City Fire Department and to stay safe. The EOC is incident coordination. You got multiple departments and agencies throughout the city. This room coordinates all those agencies to meet the needs of whatever event or incident that we have. With this COVID-19 event, there's obviously lots of different components that are going on. We have mass care in this room that's handling the shelters. Of course, we have law enforcement in this room that's supporting all the law enforcement needs. We have a fire branch in this room. The biggest part of this room we have is this logistics piece with General Services Department. They are handling all the logistical needs for this entire event. The DOC is the department's, we call it the Department Operations Center. It's a vehicle so that the administration can have up to the minute situational awareness. We take that situational awareness, we prioritize incidents that would be happening throughout the city so that we can properly allocate resources that we have available. The UHRC was established in April 2018 by the mayor's office. And what it is is a center that allows for a collaboration and coordination of events surrounding homelessness. It has representation from every department in the city so that we can tackle the very difficult and complex issues of homelessness. People experiencing homelessness, uh, they've been uh, a deep concern for the department and the city as a result of this pandemic. The testing on the street began months ago by county partners, street teams that have been embedded in uh, Skid Row and some of these known areas of the city uh, with large homeless encampments. The Los Angeles Fire Department was asked to come in to provide oversight incident command, structure, and organization to provide a pop-up testing booth. We've tested almost 400 individuals in the Skid Row area. We'll continue to do that through the quadrants that have been established and work with our partner agencies, Los Angeles Homeless Services Authority, Department of Public Health, and Department of Health Services to strategize on where the next location would be and how we can best serve this population. What we've noticed is that what we had in a concept of operation uh, has, has evolved and changed now that we've been experiencing it in real life. So we're already looking at ways that we could adjust our what we call planning P and make some adjustments so that our plan actually reflects what we're doing. 